Hello everyone, my name is Mitral and welcome back to Long War 2. So there's not much happening here right now, so let's actually just go and scan right away. We're gonna waiting on some research, some clearing and some missions to pop up I suppose. God, they are getting so much. Uh, the advanced strength here is starting to actually increase, so I think I will move most of my guys on hiding and uh, start s scanning on some other region. Maybe actually supplies as well. That's that's a good point. We probably draw, drew some attention there earlier, so... Yeah, this mission is not going to happen. Um, we might scan here. Yeah, get some guys on the intel top. Setting course for the Arctic territories. Okay, Commander Resistance Council. Uh, I don't think I have to infiltrate here. No, it's a quick, re quick response mission. So. Setting course for the Mexican Regional Tract. So, so I think we can just go in to our thing and get the hell out of dot. I mean I guess we can pretty much have a full squad here. Inez Dude Slayer. Rogue and um, maybe Buns. I kind of missed that Grenadier last time. Uh, the squad actually has. I didn't mean to remove him. I. The squad has pretty bad weapons. Is one of the few issues. The scope, huh? You don't have any crazy overwatch skills, so I don't think I don't think that will help. I guess the hyper reactive people is kind of the meh upgrade. I mean, it will give him a better chance to hit on the second shot. So it's not that uh, it's not like it's useless. Oh, we actually have the battle scanners last time. I just completely ignored them. So yeah, we definitely had laser cannons for the last mission as well, but. I guess I didn't want to use them last mission. You're not a ranger. I guess the auto loader. Or maybe. Yeah, I guess the auto loader is better. He's going to be going through that extra creep very, very fast. But... And he actually has the pistol skills, so. He will hold on to that pistol. I guess this looks kind of fine. Oh, I do have a hollow plating. Get you a laser rifle. You 
Actually, I've uh, just a shotgun. So. Again, we don't have that much armor going on, but, but not much I can do about that without any supplies. But. It's only a light mission, so maybe this this squad should probably be able to handle it. It is, it is some kind of evac resistance recruiters mission. I don't actually know if we've done this before. It might get quite hairy. But I mean, it's our okay squad, so let's let's just hit it. Let's see what happens. Uh, no FPS is what happened. <laughs> Small town in Advent Patrol Zone 10, outskirts of Tijuana. Evac resistance recruiters. Escort resistance personnel to evac point. Okay, it's, it's uh, escort mission. The sniper is probably not the smartest move there then. Oh well. I could have taken less leave with that snapshot sniping. That would have made so much more sense. Okay. Americans evac. The resistance emphasis on recruiting in this region has led to advent reprisal operation. An unarmed resistance team on our recruiting mission has been discovered by advent patrol. We must escort them to an evac point and escape. Firebrand is flying fast and low with limited fuel, so so we'll extract uh, something first. God, I hate this whole automatically scrolling thing. So, failure to rescue at least one resistance member will prevent us from conducting res recruiting in this region. She will return to pick up our troops after making an extraction, okay. So, we have to hold on after We're we get the guys out. This, uh... Oh man. I think there was a turret right here. This mission doesn't feel like light. And we don't have a shinobi. Of course we don't. On the move. Right away we got a shitload of enemies. An Archon. Fuck! I don't know, man. This is... This is pretty bad. Two threats as well. All this for one, one small move. I think that's two squats and uh, two threats. Fuck. And a freaking Archon. And that alone is just terrible nose. And bullets with the stupid assault rifle. How the hell did I miss that? At least I could uh, do some kind of rocket thing here. Huh. Okay. Uh, maybe Bulls is actually from uh, the HQ. 
Yeah, that could be. It actually makes a lot of sense. The tree tile scattering is actually... Kind of annoying. I mean... Yeah, let's try this. And it's... I think it scattered way more because we didn't even hit the damn Archon. And he was pretty much in the middle. Something with those scatters is just way off. Well, at least we exposed that mutant. I do have the rapid firing available. Could just go here and do it. It's so it's so bad that we are like this in the open. I cannot even do the double shot here. Sure thing. Oh crap. No, I don't actually have vision. I think I will take the free shot here. Still moving. Oh, this is going so well. Oh my god. Holy... I mean, uh, granted, I do have a lot of stuff like chainsaws and whatnot. So I might be able to take something down here, but uh, that, that uh, Archon is gonna wreck me. Right, even the sniper is in a very, very shitty position. He needs to move as well. Thing is, he won't be able to see anything from behind that stupid fence. This is just, this is just terrible. Maybe I should forget about the Archon. Try to kill whatever I can. Let the Archon do whatever he will. I mean, I I can't leave my guys in the open. So one shot is almost able to kill him. I think I will uh, try to save up the chain shot. Down. At least that mutant won't get the chance to go on us. This is actually kind of interesting. Oh, this is even a full cover. Oh, but I cannot get the Archon from here. Which was the full or whole point of that move. This guy has 21 hit points, that's so insane. And it's so goddamn hard to hit as, as always. So he has the mayhem. We do have the command available. So I might be actually able to get two rapid shots or rapid fires, whatever. Fairly certain I might actually bring down this Archon with one turn, but that would leave dirt certainly in the open. But I guess I can suppress these guys. I mean, if I can kill this Archon, that would be huge. That would be absolutely huge. could I do? I could actually go here and just blast the mutant. Or maybe this is better position to blast the Archon from. How 
much damage would that do? That might do a lot of damage. The thing is, the mutant will get a good, good shoot. Good shoot, shoot, <laughs> good uh, shot at us if I move here because he can move and flank him. I'm not sure if I want to feed my guys to the mutant just yet. I do have a second rocket. But these rockets don't really do much after moving. Uh, James would have a flanking shot on the guy, on the mutant. He does have insane uh, skills for the rockets and stuff. So what if I don't move him? Can I get all three? No. I can't quite reach all three of you guys there. I'm gonna see what my options are from here. I mean, there's always the chance that the that the the, the Archon just does something stupid like those launch rocket things. Mm, this might be pretty good rocket. Yeah, let's oh. try. I think I will just leave the Archon B. Run it and gun it. Try to just take out Running. as many as I can. Did you see that one? No, I'm actually thinking maybe I should have gone for the Archon. <laughs> I guess that's how it works, huh? What's over there? I think I can uh, rabbit target the Archon. <sighs> I might be able to take him down. I can actually take a shot as well on him. Or holo target somebody else. Huh. I think I will leave that open for now. Okay, Bounce has grenades. I don't think those grenades can reach these guys, no matter how much I move. I guess that'll be okay. Yeah. The question is, do I go for the Archon or not? I think I will. Agreed. I might yet to, yet live to regret this decision though. Yeah, let's do it. Oh god. Instant regret. That's just that's not a thing. It's what what is going to happen. I think we will actually try to take out this turret. I 
do have pretty good shots on these guys in the back. Change shot, uh, it's only 56% shot, so... I can just simple normal shot this. Well, I can really can. Do I take the current did kill on the turret? Yes, this might actually blow up the car. Cause some heavy damage on this guy. Let's actually try it. Down. Seems be simple because he has all these crazy skills. Okay, that actually might have done the trick. There's only the VIPs and I need this hit pick. Nice. Hostile target Asset located. Down. I mean that was pretty nice regardless of what happens next. But there may be some mayhem coming in. There's so many. Oh, and the reinforcements. <laughs> this is this is insane. It's only two main reinforcements, so I guess it could be a lot worse. Got some advent here. She's just gonna oh, what's her me? Okay, bastard. Oh fuck. What the hell is this shit, man? I'm not a freaking squad. And of course, they take the pre shots. I need a med kit here. Holy shit. I mean, that guy shot through the full cover. Once again. Whoa! What just happened? That's gonna be highly annoying. Okay, at least that guy was too strong. Why him? Oh, for fuck's sake! Knock the wind out of me. The stupid. Give it a try. Stupid full cover doesn't do jack shit. I should know that by now, I suppose. Okay, so I actually need to kill this guy first. And I don't have a. Do I even have a way to do that? You have the lightning reflexes, so. There's just so many of these freaking guys. I don't have the run and gun, I don't have anything. Holy fuck, this is bad. I think that's that has to be the mission, right? I do have a small chance with the command again on the on dirt. So let's see, I could take out this guy then probably take out the turret then leave him in the open to die pretty much because we need to we need to deal with these guys as well can I actually remove disorient I can I mean, one guy already down, that's just so terrible. 
Hopefully we can change up this. Of course it's a bad shot. We are just not doing enough damage anymore. I mean this is nothing. I only scratched him. Indeed. And you are positioned so badly. Flamethrower this guy, but I mean, that doesn't do many damage. I'm sure, take the shots with James first because he can shred him. Deflection. These guys are so fucking tough. I mean, I've done nothing with all the shots. Absolutely freaking nothing. Okay, maybe this chain shot will. Can he kill it without the chain shot? Yes, I believe so. Just seven damage. Holy shit. Unfortunately, that guy is in. Terrible spot to take that shot. So what do I do? I cannot command from here, that's for sure. So let's say I move here, I take out the shield burr. I reload. I take out the heavy turret maybe. They will have a free shot, so many free shots. I can't even kill this elite officer. He has way too much hit point. Only reason I'm... I mean the shield bearer isn't that much big of a threat, but I think he's in the only position where I could do something crazy like that. Just take the rapid shot. Or rapid fire. Command. This guy is in full cover. Other move would be here, but then I cannot command. Unless I move my guy into some. No, I cannot move her. Oh shit, and she's actually flanked. I didn't even notice that. <sighs> she's flanked by Bolt, right? So I could come here and no, but he will be dead. He will be dead for sure. I think this is as uh, as bad as this is. It's probably the best move. I mean, there's so many guys all around, and somebody, somebody. I think somebody will just die. And we're getting flanked so many from so many different directions. I guess I could just try to suppress this guy. Hope that that takes care of him. Should I move first is the question. Sniper has slim shot on this guy, but I think I will actually prefer to take out the turret. Should I make it? I guess uh, nobody. Do we have a shredding? Oh, we have AP ammo, so this should be a. Yeah, this should be enough to kill the turret. That's it! <laughs> and even with all that, we're still so screwed. I guess I could actually go for the flank shot. The Viper will. Uh, do Viper things, but I can't do much about that. 
Ah, oh, but Rick has that stupid... Stupid assault rifle with AP ammo, of course. Maybe him being on fire... Make him want to attack less. Is that, is that really all I have? I'm sure she will be dead. Dead? She will be dead if I leave her there. So, rest of my guys are kinda in full cover. Or some kinda cover at least. I, mean, I guess I could just back off a little bit and uh, take rapid fire here. Just try to play it safer than going all in with some uh, weird moves. Yeah. Seems doable. I really need this to be enough, but I don't think it will. Will be. Yeah. Oh. Holy shit. You know about something here. <sighs> that was huge crit, man. Absolutely huge. Yeah, I think I will move Megan in some kind of some kind of cover there isn't much. Acknowledged. I really would prefer not to lose her. Holy shit. That actually did a lot more damage than I thought it would. I mean... Then I have podiums and I think I will just... Supras here. Enemy locked down. They will get shields, but I just have to leave with that, I suppose. Yeah, the viper is taking him. That's Probably actually not the worst option. <laughs> it turns out it was pretty bad option. How? I mean, this is one of those smaller maps, so these always get pretty insane. I. It's a freaking light mission. Oh yeah, they can still shoot him, of course. And he will take the shot. And shred, why not? Probably has some special ammo. Help! Help! Someone help! Panic. That's not good. Who's got a med kit? Yeah, he's dead. I don't know how he could actually. I guess he's just dead. <sighs> Killed by fire. Ready to walk. Just kill that damn swiper. Oh come on. I mean these laser weapons are just not doing it anymore. These guys Freaking joke is what it is. <sighs> this guy has just so much, so much hit points. Oh. On the margins. Could use some ammo over here. 
They won't be doing any more fighting. <sighs> yeah, I think they will do plenty of fighting. Guess I can use uh, another revival protocol here. So that's something. Now that they also have the shields, they are even harder to kill. Locked and loaded. But I mean, I could get pretty good flank shots. I might take out the rocketer. I don't think there are any more enemies in this map because this is a, quite a lot. This guy has 12 hit points. I might be able to take him out. Of course, I would love to take out the shield bear, but um, yeah, I don't think that's happening. I can handle that. Mm, yeah, it's actually pretty bad. <laughs> I th for a moment, I thought it wasn't that bad, but yeah. It it's pretty bad. One more. Okay. Well, how about that? At least he's out. Yeah, I can't, can't command him because I don't have a vision, but I think I will heal him instead. I do have one uh, chain shot available, but, but it's kind of hard to use that right now. Sniper has a uh, selection of bad shots, really. This guy is. Uh, it's a problem for sure. Can't really get... I could get some kind of head advantage shots at him. He's in low cover. He's also on fire, so he might just die to the fire, maybe. I mean, he won't take the five damage, but if I can throw something, something at him, might get some kind of pistol shots from here. I mean, what else I can do? These shots are terrible and don't accomplish that much. If you say so. the hell? Really? Oh, he's right there. 17% shot. <sighs> yeah, I don't think that will happen. Maybe go up here and just suppress him. And just suppress him from here. And G person shot is not gonna be very good. Mm. The problem with this guy is that he's flanking basically our whole team. Did I take a shot? Blanco I took a shot. Well, that was meant to be a suppression, but... Crazy hit. God damn it. I mean, if I hit him with the pistol, there is just that very small chance that he dies to the fire. Shot wide.
Yeah, he would have died if if he did any damage. But obviously, we didn't. I mean, there's just so many, but we really cannot run run past them either because they are blocking the way to the freaking extraction zone. Oh god, here he goes. 100% hit. I don't mind the Overwatch. Zombie is kind of bad. But uh, it's really not the worst thing <laughs> to happen in this mission. Okay, he wasted his actions. Lucky me. Jesus! Whoa, and he's still in trouble. Ah. Three to damage. To a crisp. <laughs> wow. Just wow. I think I have to go for the commander. I don't think I can take him down, so... That is the... That is the problem. Maybe I can take down the shield burr. Yeah, I really don't care about... Care about the zombie. Hmm, I don't remember which one it gave all the shields. It's probably this guy in the back. Look to make it a critical, so... Oh shit. Freaking races. That was not some. I mean, sure enough, they have saved my squad so many times this mission alone. I don't. That I don't even know. Can I trust the fire to do that? Couple damage it needs to do. So I could technically flame throw again. Might actually catch these two guys in the back. And him. Yeah, I don't think the flame drawer has such range. And that, that will definitely kill Bill, I believe. Maybe not because he's already down. Let's I see. Understand. Oh shit, they all watch. Yeah, that did absolutely nothing. Great! Joy is this done? My ammo is running low. This is such a suicidal move, but I mean, I have to do something, right? All I got is desperate moves. Can't really see anything useful from here. From here I can Can I kill him without the ten shot? Not even close. Come on. No, he died. And it was the wrong one. Of course. Oh. 
shit. I mean, it was such a long shot anyway, so I don't... I don't know if that even would have done anything for us. Maybe I can grenade throw and blow up the truck. Who knows? Or maybe even get lucky enough and kill that sector. Oh yeah. So that's something. At least those flanking guys are gonna deal with that. That sucks so hard that I hit the guy who <laughs> wasn't the correct shield bearer. I think I need to leave the elite officer alive. Not much I can do about him. I could certainly do some kind of rapid firing spree here. There's actually a door here, so I might. I think I will just do that. Moving to fire position. This will pro probably go down at some point because. Well, I mean, look at him. Or maybe I should... Yeah, I can... Can't kill the sector, can I? Although it's more likely than killing the shield barrel. This would get rid of the zombies. Please let me command him. Can't. Hmm. Move here and command him from here, but uh, I think it's the one shot he can do doesn't really do that much to anyone. And it's a heavy lancer as well, right there. Just that flanking of elite officer as well. These moves will actually make any Absolutely. anything happen. This move, Fine. especially. <laughs> okay. I think I've done pretty much the best I can in these situations, I will say. I was hoping I could command uh, Dirt, but I don't think he can. Take out this shield bearer with 10 hit points and 2 armor anyway. So maybe I'll just heal him. Wish him best of luck. Let's probably move in the position where I'm not open to that elite guy. Acknowledged. It's probably better than healing. Yeah. Adjusting sights. I'm hit. I'm hit. Oh shit! Six damage. Watch the flanks. They're moving. I'm not so elite officer. That's shooting. Be a possible shot. Oh fuck. She's flying. Oh, he didn't go for it. <sighs> Thank god, I suppose. The boot is bleeding out. I 
I mean... They're bringing in reinforcements! It wasn't that terrible, actually. But it certainly wasn't good. I mean, this guy is so, so annoying, he's... And our sort of charts has trash. change that is on cooldown and uh, I could go for the hail of bullets I suppose it won't be that great because uh, I would be standing right next to him and these guys don't actually like that or I could go for the shield bearer as well With that hail of bullets Thing is, the silver only gives them three hit points. I'm gonna see what. What the hell? The hell happened? All right, this was the only a guarantee to hit. I thought it was the one where you get uh, three shots. <laughs> That could be a costly mistake, don't I? For whatever reason, I only see this guy as well. Not the move. Not the right move. Right, this asshole needs to die. Three shots, huh? These guys will live one more turn, so I can... I can maybe take him out with Megan here. That won't be able to do much this turn then. We don't see the turret here. I could go and uh, take out the turret, I suppose, but uh, is that the. Is that the thing, huh? I mean, that would put him in certainly in danger. Guess I could aid protocol him. I think uh, killing the turret is the only thing he can do, but even that is uh, very risky. I mean, I could take this guy out, but then the turret will absolutely slaughter. Slaughter dirt. There's no no way to get any good shots uh, because of the stupid turret. The turret was also in full health, I believe, so this might not go as I would love it to go. This would leave me in full cover. I think that's better. You say. Get the rid, of, rid of that uh, all as well. Yeah, I don't think I will actually even kill that turret. Probably should have just stayed out of sight. Deflection. This was such a such a mistake. Yeah, the knife. Knife doesn't really <laughs> do anything. Do I just keep going? Hope that he doesn't notice me. I mean ten percent. Oh, he's considered to be in high cover, huh? 
for whatever reason this is not actually I cannot actually flank into that direction. That's why I cannot take the shot. My options are staying inside or going further, further into here. This might actually confuse the AI more, I feel. But he's out of ammo. I think I have to take this shot to get rid of the heavy launcher. I was hoping I would be able to get rid of him with someone else, but it doesn't seem to be happening. And I need this hit. Shit. That won't do it. Crazes, crazes, crazes. Okay. I think I can pistol him with the lining ads. Really? No vision from here? But you get vision from here? It's not cool. might be the best spot then. I'm away. Since it's a free pistol shot, I might be able to reload after taking this. Okay. By the numbers. Let's rock. Alright, I get the free action as well. Or free move. <sighs> yeah, let's Heading out. Let's see if we can smoke up this elite officer. Question is, do I even want to try to stabilize those two? I mean... I do want to, but, but, but it's not very realistic, is it? I feel it's better to just heal of dirt. I think he's, he's the key for victory. Oh, I could have commanded him. I still could, but I think it's more... Actually, do I even have that ability? Yeah. I, I think I have to jump this. I even have a remote chance of getting it the hell out of here. I think I will just start running. full behind a wall or something Get this guy wants to come out oh no no wonder he wanted to come out holy shit Get the shields are removed finally Last free reload, I assume. Rock and roll. Oh, son of a bitch! <sighs> the sniper is out of out of shooting range of anyone. You are out of ammo. I feel like Ines is pretty much screwed down here. 
of ammo these guys can't do jack shit. They might be able to flame that guy on the above, I suppose. Although it's probably not going to happen either. You have the command. So taking out the turret would all of our guys actually run. I will probably use both of my moves though. Mm, he's in full cover, that bastard. It's a damn shame that the sniper cannot see anything. These guys are just pretty much Ift up here. Oh yeah, he's he's basically on fire. Is he already on fire? No, he's just smart. Yes, I can take it. Just take this shot on him. Hunger down. Suppress this guy. Even the lucky shots are. Stand yeah, this boy. barrel is going to explode next turn. <laughs> yeah, so he's he's more likely than not dead. Okay, let's just move here and take out the turret and fuck's sake. I mean, I would love to be able to somehow command him and take out this uh, silver as well, but that's also so terrible. I don't, I don't think there's a, there's a way to do that. Guess I could keep suppressing this guy. I don't think they will actually care about the suppression at all. And why should they? Because they can just run through it. That's not cool. I'm fairly certain that these guys cannot actually pick up bodies, so... I guess I could command the sniper to get the shot on the turret, but uh, can dirt actually do anything with the, with the rest of his actions? He might be able to kill that officer. Might be able to do just that. Seems doable. Okay. I'm trusting you here. I'm actually putting I'm sorry, Bull. I think uh, I think my best best is just to keep healing dirt. Yes. Okay, I've got to try. Oh, son of a bitch. I was gonna command him, but you can't command him if he's not in range. 
That was a strike of genius. I will still go for this. How is the turret is doing? Too bad there will be more enemies coming in. Right. Let's just flash bomb this one. Time to go. Actually, let's just run. This is absolutely insane, Miss Santa. Hello, boys. Just a casual drop of three guys behind us. So he moved to reload. Oh shit. He there. I've been down here. Put it out! Put it out! Unfortunately, I don't think that actually accomplished that much because. These guys in the back will absolutely just murder us. Are you on fire now? Yeah, you are on fire now. And I can do chuck shit about that. Fantastic. Somehow he's, he's also out of ammo. care about the turret to be honest. I mean these guys, uh, some of these guys have a pretty few hit points. These are actually not that bad guys. I think I can actually flame her from here. I'm going. Toasty. Yeah they make one take damage. But Mutant didn't take that much to miss either. Good thing. Actually, I should have tried to run him out. Still need to take care of that. Make anti mutant. I mean, what the hell, man? I can run and gun and take care of this guy, but these, these two will be... They will be killing our guys. I don't think I actually need to... Well, I should run and gun because uh, otherwise I won't be in cover. For Although the silver isn't really the biggest danger anymore. Well, how about this is that? It, right? I've got it. Basically, we have a two shot. What's this? Interesting. Not good enough. I would need this crap shot to hit. To kill the mutant and then. Uh, 
Hey, my airport local to draw. This is pretty insane. Guess I could use the command here as well. Okay. I mean, I could go for the really desperate play and uh, mind control him, but I guess the shutdown is good enough. Oh, did that in my turn. Son of a... I'm fairly certain that Tooltip didn't say that it would end the turn. I mean, I should know that by now. And you don't hit any. Negative damage. Well, that means somebody is dead. Those titties, as they say. Maybe I should have just run those guys as well. What to do here? I don't really know. Try to sneak out or run out. Hope that the guy keeps missing. No, but there's the turret. <laughs> uh, the turret will see me from there as well. I think it's better to run than try to do some kind of suppression hey, place here. We can't uh, kill that guy this turn anyway. Ah! Yep, another one down. At least poor Jones took some fire. I mean, he was dead and he was also in full cover and got mauled. So. That all you got, Commander? We can't afford to take losses like this. The objective isn't worth the lives of our remaining troops. I'd recommend we abort while we still can. You know what? You were, you you probably were right from the beginning. I'm all over it. I should have run. Guns running options are quite limited. Can dirt do anything nasty before? He might be able to take out that turret. I'm going! So, at least. At least that shouldn't be an issue anymore. We're kind of gonna get shot from all the directions, I believe, so it's going to be nasty. But I mean, it looks like the VIP is much over. Yeah, he's in, he's in cover as well, so... That shot doesn't do much. Venga, vamos, vamos. There's more. Oh no, that's a mech waking up. Alright. Jesus. No, I'm not, I'm not, no. That bullshit accuracy. That's actually... Well, I mean the end zone is kind of in that direction, so maybe... Yeah, this is better cover. 
I mean, I'm fairly certain that somebody will survive this mission, but holy shit, the cost. At least we took care of the mission. Oh right, I forgot about this. <laughs> we have to, we have to fade for for four turns. Oh, I mean shit. Annoyingly, this. Uh, I mean, these guys played played it smart. Just gonna just go there and kill him. Well, keep running. Out. It will take about four turns to get there anyway, so. Forces on the ground. It's not a big chance of plans. Please shoot here. Mm, what's the point? Uh, There's just so many. We can't take all of them down. It's probably just way better to run as far as I can and hope that somebody survives. Mm, just probably run with dirt first. Ten four. Right, that suppression not a oh what so don't actually do anything. Well rogue I don't think the integrated comes through will help us. You kinda need to get lucky now, so this is garbage. Got it. Well, at least you got lucky ones. What a terrible mission. What a terrible, absolutely terrible mission. Already there. The worst part of course is that it's it's not even over yet. Vale, voy. Get a second all what's here for reason. Since we need to kinda of burn a couple of turns. Still very well, uh, uh, dull because I'll die because uh, they're so low. Tengo que mejorar. Suppression, huh? One more turn, eh? Person chance to kill that guy. Or, uh, well, at least do some heavy damage. I might be able to get that mutant. Yeah, not so much. Yep. Not even close. It's still alive. Okay, we go for the low chance then. Low chance is a no chance in this game. 
really hate to get rocketed now, so <laughs> I'm gonna actually spread up. Oh, he ran out of ammo. That might save something. Never mind, Timmy was able to flank us. Fuck. Jesus. Rogue was one of our most skilled guys. I might be able to this is firebrand. save to one. Go. No seat firebrand. Whatever you say. What a stupid ass person. I can take him. Seems doable. Getting wow. Out of here. <sighs> All surviving XCOM well. operatives are secure. Firebrand returning to base. Status confirmed. That? Mission accomplished. <laughs> rating fair, I would say the rating was fucking terrible. Holy shit, that was bad. Somehow three guys survived. One? No, that must have been some bug. Maybe that's the VIP, we say, one of them. I mean, he certainly looks like a soldier. I don't know what happened. But that was, that was pretty ridiculous mission, who? I'm actually, I should probably be happy that we got somebody out of that alive, it was so insane. Should have just ran the VIPs in earlier. But I mean... Uh, running wasn't really an option because the enemies were built. It didn't go so well. Between this Maybe point. I can improve our weapons or armor somehow. Give our troops yeah, better odds. I don't think we would have supplies to buy new weapons anyway. Well, not the funnest mission, but uh, at least we still have got some guys left to kill. Or get killed. At least our alpha squad is still <laughs> going strong. And I'm just changing the next mission. But... Uh, there's some hope that it wasn't game-ending disaster, although that was a huge hit. That was absolutely a huge hit. Well, okay, that's enough for this episode, so see you guys on the next one. See you there.